Welcome to another short story from me, Mikey Campling, and a little dark story for you. This one is called simply Floorboards. Simon knew that on a cold night like this, the old oak floorboard shifted and creaked. It didn't bother him. It gave the place character. It was a good, solid home built to stand the test of time, and Simon felt safe, even though he was alone. Alone. Just the way he liked it. He enjoyed the stillness, the solitude, and it was even better if, like tonight, the empty rooms were wrapped in soft velvet darkness. So, as he began his careful routine of checking the rooms on the ground floor, he did not switch on the ceiling lights, nor did he use any of the table lamps. Their unkind glare would be most unwelcome. And anyway, he had no need of extra illumination. His eyes had grown accustomed to the gloom, and he sensed the subtle shifts in the depths of the shadows as he slipped softly from room to room. In the hallway, he paused and tilted his head to one side. Another creak from the floorboards above. He stood perfectly still and closed his eyes. Silly man, he thought. After all, what could there possibly be to frighten him in an empty house? He headed toward the stairs. It was time. But as he placed his foot on the bottom step, he heard something that made him stop in his tracks. And this time, he was sure. This time, it could not have been his imagination. Slowly, he turned to seek out the source of the sound. There, the old-fashioned telephone sat on a small table in the hallway, and it was the only thing that could have made the small, insistent, single beep that had shocked Simon to the core. The blood drained from his face. Somewhere in the dark house, someone had just picked up one of the other handsets. This was the only thing that could have caused the main phone to make that sound. He was not alone. Simon fought the urge to rush to the phone and grab the handset. If I do that, he thought, they'll know exactly where I am. And how would they react? Simon ran a hand over his face. Whoever it was, he mustn't panic them. He took a breath and carried on up the stairs, moving as quickly as he could. He placed his weight carefully on each step, his shoes sinking gently into the thick carpet. He did not make a sound. In moments he reached the top of the stairs. Here the same thick carpet would muffle his furtive footsteps. He crossed to the nearest door and stood listening. Yes, this was the place. From beyond the door came the faintest traces of a man's voice, hushed and urgent. Simon leaned closer to the door, pressed his ear against the painted wood. And now he could just make out the words. Yes, they said. I'm sure you must come quickly. There's, there's somebody in my house. I hope you enjoyed that little story called Floorboards. If you did, it's going to be uh, up on my website, and um, I think it is already. And the audio version will be up. Usually I keep the um, the audio you can play, but if you want to download it easily, then that's uh, sign up to the newsletter and you'll get access to all that. Uh, and any other MP3s I've got, um, plus some free books and other exclusive content, which is just for subscribers to the Awkward Squad newsletter, uh, which gets sent out quite rarely, really. But you do you get the automated ones to make sure you get all the free stuff. Um, otherwise, that wouldn't really be fair, would it? So everybody gets all the free stuff. Um, and that book is coming up in a collection which will be published before too long, I hope. Um, the first draft is, um, no, sorry, the revised draft is all done and it's, you know, just being final uh, spit and polish and formatting all that sort of thing, uh, which will at the moment be called A Dark Assortment. And that uh, you can get a free copy of that, an advanced reader copy by signing up to a specialist on my website. I'll make sure there's a link there. Um, thank you very much for watching and listening. Um, you can catch up with me on Facebook, Twitter, at Mikey Campling, 
quite easy to find. Um, all the links are on mikeycampling.com. Thank you. That's it for today. Bye.